hello everyone um welcome back to my channel and to today's video so it is like maybe 8 30 9 o'clock in the evening and it is the night before my surgery um i'm actually feeling really good right now um i was thinking a lot about it on my way home from work and i started to get a little nervous again but actually right now i'm doing fun um i'm kind of just keeping myself busy tonight. I'm running around cleaning the house because I really want to come home to a clean house. Um, I was talking on the phone with my mom a few minutes ago because she's going to go with me and Tyler in the morning. And I told her, I was like, I'm acting like this is my last meal, like <laughs> all this stuff. So um, this evening I ordered out a meal from like one of my favorite places. We got the cheesecake with it. Like we went all out. I even got me a um, Starbucks uh, cold brew because it's amazing and I never hardly ever get Starbucks um, but it's just so good so I'm kind of like treating myself trying to make it not so negative and um, just kind of treat myself because in the morning I can't eat until after the surgery and my surgery is not until 1 o'clock so at 12 o'clock tonight I'm cut off so I'm trying to like you know feed my body so maybe I won't get as hungry tomorrow morning um, right now I'm feeling all right but honestly definitely some nerves I am gonna pack a bag just in case um, I know that some people like it is definitely an outpatient procedure but I have seen where some people have been admitted um, depending on what they find I think that's the scariest part of it all is you don't really know what's in there until they get in there so um, hopefully it's pretty you know routine and he's able to take it out and I can just come on home and just kind of rest and recover and hopefully it's not too painful but I don't know that I'm gonna film tomorrow I really want to be in a really good headspace and just be like chill and zen about it and not really worry about anything else um so like I mentioned Tyler's going with me my mom's going with me they're both nurses so they make me feel a little bit more comfortable um that way if anything is going on um they can kind of recognize it and help me um you know after the surgery and everything but unfortunately only Tyler can come in there with me they can he can be in pre-op after that he has to go in the waiting room my mom will have to stay in the car um, but just to have her there with me nearby because it is about a three hour drive for us. Um, so yeah, I did stop and I bought a few things just to make sure that I'm comfortable. So I did get two kind of t-shirt dresses that are very loose and comfy and definitely something I would wear whether I was having surgery or not so that I can wear it again. I did get some bras that don't have like metal in them. So hopefully they'll let me still wear them. Um, my mom was telling me all this stuff cause she's, she knows all this stuff. So, so I did get that just in case I might be able to still wear that. Um, just to be comfortable. I have to shower and when I wash, I have to use, Oh, I've got it right here. This stuff. Um, it's called, Hibiclens. I don't know what this is, but basically it is the CHG wash. Um, it's just to kind of helps protect against getting infections in the incision sites. So I do have to do that tonight and in the morning. I can't wear makeup, can't wear contacts, um, all the normal stuff with surgery. So yeah, I'm just kind of preparing, getting the house ready. All the positive vibes thank you all so much for all of your you know prayers and support over the past month um, once I said that I was gonna do the surgery um, that's what's happening and I will update you all um, yeah either in the morning or after surgery so here we go do you want to give your thoughts babe this might be the only time we vlog today huh why would it be the only time because <laughs> I don't know if I can later it's the morning of. I curled my hair, but I can't do anything else. No makeup, nothing. Um, so it's about seven o'clock. We're waiting on mom to get here. Um, Cause she's gonna ride with us. So feeling a little nervous, not gonna lie. Hey. 
Hey, are you on your way? Yes, I had forgot my phone. Had to turn and go. All right, bye. Bye. Love you, so -so. <laughs> She's like, what are y'all doing? I think that she knows Dirk doesn't anymore. I think he was acting like it last night. Bah, 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 we'll be back. Are you unamused? So this is the dress that I got. It came in a two pack. So there's the striped one and then it has the black one. And it's just like a little t-shirt dress. And then my kind of flowy cardigan. They said to wear something flowy and comfortable. So I'm hoping this will work. Babe, do you wanna go ahead and get in the car? Let's go get in the car and pull out so she just can hop in. Bye Zoe, we'll be back. Hopefully all goes well. Dirky, bye bye bye. We love you. <laughs> They're so funny. I also tried to clean my car out last night. I didn't vacuum and stuff, but I did clean it all out. So we would have a clean car to drop down in. And I did end up cleaning like a mad woman last night. So I cleaned the entire house and um, yeah, I don't know. I just cleaned the entire house. So when I get home, it'll be clean. But I ended up not going to bed until about 2 a.m. I started, my mind just started going. I just started worrying again about everything. And I'll show a little picture of the actual like daily devotional that I read before I went to bed last night. It's not the right date for the year, but it was literally like perfect for my day and like perfect for my time in my life. So I thought that was pretty cool and I'll share that with you all. It definitely, I don't know, is what I needed in that moment. Okay, so they just brought us So they just brought us back for pre-op. So we're in the pre-operating room area. And they just told me that my surgery was pushed back another hour. And Tyler got us here an hour early. But luckily we're back here. So I'm just going to get changed and try to stay calm. Tyler wants me to do an update. So I got the IV. Um, don't show it too much. I don't want to gross people out. But, um, they gave me some like pain medication. I'm having a little trouble keeping my oxygen up, but the nurse was awesome. She numbed it before she did it, so I'm just trying not to look at it. Cause you all know I have a history of like passing out. So I have a lot of weight now. Probably a couple hours. Oh, that's all I got. I'm a little emotional, kind of. I don't know. Oh, but it's on the vacation. Okay, I'm good. Not necessarily of all being at the destination when the scene is starting, or a matter of fact, where do you think you're going to be in the future? Am I not a ghost thing? You could say she's a little restless right now. <laughs> How you oh, feeling? I feel relaxed, but still uncomfortable. I did have to get up and I had to get up and use the bathroom, so they had to like detach everything. So I felt kind of bad about that. But we just talked to the doctor, so we're getting ready. I don't know how long anesthesia has got to come down here, and then we're headed up there. I don't know what else to say. I'm getting really nervous. <laughs> what do you think, babe? Everything's fine. Mm. Tyler keeps filming me. Okay, babe.
We are, are we halfway or no? About an hour in? We're an hour in on our way home and I had to use the bathroom so bad. <laughs> so we made that work and now I'm trying to um, eat something. They got me a Chick-fil-A sandwich. Um, Cause I haven't ate since yesterday. Oh, we didn't update them. So what time did we leave? I don't know. We left at like s a little after seven. So we literally left the hospital a little after seven. No. Eight. It was after it eight. Was, yeah. Show mom. I gotta show that she came with us. <laughs> she stayed in the car the whole time. She was a trooper. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we left at what? A little after eight. So it was a long day. <laughs> Babe, I'm, I'm done. You can say something. You don't want to say what he said about the. We'll do that later. I don't want to do that. Though. 